Hey, what's up guys, Eskazoo here, and welcome to episode 12 of Skillet to Glory. First of all, apologies for no episode yesterday. I really wanted to, uh, to get it out yesterday, but then I think it would have been way too late. So I um, decided to uh, get it uploaded today instead. But anyway, we start off with the first game, come up against a very strong side. And as you all know, we uh, have only one challenge left, which is score defensive finish. So uh, that was definitely my aim for, uh, for this episode. So um, yeah, as I said, we kept against a very strong team. A lot of aim forms, uh, very deadly attacks. So I was kind of afraid that uh, he would pretty much dominate me, but uh, it was actually the opposite. We played very, very well in the first half. We pretty much gave away no chances at all in that half. And uh, it was us just getting most of the chances in this game. Even though we only started getting some proper chance at the end of the first half. We uh, did get quite a few which uh, maybe could have gone in. Uh, here as well for my uh, short free kick. Uh, my opponent actually messed up a couple of seconds later. Because he wanted to pass to one of his midfielders. We intercepted here with Traore. And then a very good finish into the back of the net. Uh, pretty much whilst he was standing still, you can see it from the replay. Uh, good touch there, turns around, shoots into the far corner and gives us a very, very late lead. And you can see from half time, he had no chances at all. We had more possession, uh, most of the shots, so uh, it was actually going very well, surprisingly. Then to the second half we go, we get a very nice pass going here from Marquisio whilst he was pretty much on his knees. Uh, from that we get a very nice attack going as well. A bit of 1-2 passing, Ziyech turns around, bit of shielding work, plays it on through to Traore, who goes with a fancy finish and then hits the freaking post. That would have been, or at least should have been, the goal that uh, that would have completed the challenge. But unfortunately we hit the post, you can see it from the replay as well. Very, very annoying. And uh, oh man, I was, I was so gutted that I actually didn't go in because it was like the first kind of attempt as well at it. And uh, yeah, it would have been amazing if it went in straight away. But um, yeah, the remaining minutes in this game were for us as well. Got more chances. My opponent uh, kept on uh, making a couple of mistakes, which we unfortunately did not finish off. Then 85th minute, very late in the game. You can see as well from his attack that he went uh, with a bit of shielding, which was maybe his gameplay style. Hence why I didn't create that many chances as I was able to defend it quite well. But he also did get himself a huge chance towards the end of the game which resulted in him hitting the post. But uh, luckily enough, we uh, we ended up winning that game 1-2-0. And uh, that means we'll be moving on. It will be the second game of the episode. And yet again, we got up against a strong side in the 4-3-2-1 formation. Very strong attack with Martial, Sturridge and also uh, Mane. And uh, this time we do start off things off uh, very early here. A long shot here with Ziyech. I just really want to score an amazing goal with him. Uh, either a long shot, a free kick or I don't know, a skill run. He only has three star skill moves so it's a bit difficult to skill with him. But I just really, really want to see, like, score a good goal with him. Since he is uh, one of my favorite players in real life when it comes to the Dutch league. Uh, I still think though he, uh, he deserves 4 star skill moves. But that's maybe for a different day. Anyway, of course, in this game as well, try to get that... Uh, that fancy finish going since uh, we still hadn't completed it yet, even though we were very close in the previous game. We get a very nice attack going here with Mastur, plays it on through here to Ziyech, who then goes inside the box, goes with the ball to great space, and then a great finish into the back of the net to make it 1-0 just before half time, and uh, actually get us first goal uh, with this team, surprisingly. Then moving on into the second half, a cheeky pen there from Traraway, plays it on through to Belhanda on the left hand side. Great skill move there to beat the defender there. We cross it in back to uh, Belhanda or Marquiso, I think it was. And a bit of padding attack from my opponent. And we almost get sort of a back we shot in with Marquiso. At least that's what I tried to do. Unfortunately, it ended up being a normal shot instead. Uh, even though it was just the perfect way to uh, to go for a back heel, basically. The 55th minute, we get past the goalkeeper. And after it, I wanted to go for the fence shot again. But this time he went with a uh, sort of a slight tackle shot. I think it was just because he wasn't really like standing properly. Um, he went with that kind of variation instead. And um, yeah, I maybe just should have gone with the fancy pass immediately instead of like going with the, with the heel flick or something. But um, yeah, still a goal made it 2-0. No, that we got ourselves another chance to try to go for a low cross. The cross was very bad, but the shot was even worse, I think, with uh, with Mastur. And moving on, 75th minute, some great stuff going here with Mastur. Beats two defenders there with the Berber spin. And also the Ronaldo chop. Then the shot wasn't the greatest. Good save there from his goalkeeper. Then uh, we move on towards the end of the game in the 89th minute. Uh, we go in the attack here with Ziyech, who then plays it on through here to Traore. Beats the defender there with the heel flick. Then he goes 1-1 -on -one with the goalkeeper. We go with the ball to the fancy shot. And it actually went in in the 90th minute. And to make it even better, look at the replay. We actually pan at the goalkeeper at the same time as well. What a way to uh, pretty much finish off this game. 
and complete the challenge as well. It was just the perfect goal pretty much. Then in the 90th minute, my opponent got kind of frustrated. I think he picked up a direct red card there with Zuma, which resulted in a free kick for us. Uh, would have been nice if we actually managed to uh, shoot this one in as well with Siek. Unfortunately, a good save there from his goalkeeper. And uh, that's basically how the game ended. So uh, we end up winning 3-0. We uh, scored an amazing goal with Traore at the very, very end of the game, pretty much in extra time. And um, yeah, I was really happy that we uh, that we got that goal finally, uh, especially uh, especially that late in the game was just amazing. So uh, you can see right there, uh, completed all the challenges. I think we had two games left with the Mastur skill squad. So that obviously means we're able to open two extra packs as well. But um, for the next episode, we're going to be playing with a new five-star skiller, which is Chanturia. So if you have any cool squads that you want to send in, then make sure to do so. Um, I would love to see like the Inform Promes, the striker version, and also the man of the match version of uh, Manuel Fernandez from Lokomotiv Moscow included, since those are the two players I really want to try out as well. And since they both play in the Russian League, just like John Turia, it would be uh, nice to see them as well. So if you have any cool ideas for squads, then uh, make sure to, uh, to send them in. But anyway, that's where we're going to be ending off this episode. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then make sure to leave a like. would be very much appreciated. So thank you very much for watching, and I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.